Hello everybody, what's up and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we are going to be talking about Anna Matskovich and about all the information that I've uncovered and unveiled with the help of Caitlin Hepner from Instagram. And honestly, I appreciate her so much because she sent through a whole bunch of things that I could look through. Just kind of briefly touching on the previous video that I did about Anna, I didn't actually know if she was actually missing, but that's what a lot of people were saying. So that's why I said TikTok woman has been missing since 2014 because people said that she's been missing since 2014. So obviously I'm going to put that in the title. And obviously TikTok wasn't around in 2014. What I was meaning by TikTok woman is that's where a lot of us know her from. We don't know her from anywhere else. And I'm just talking about the people who have just found out about Anna. But with that said, let's get into the video. So if I look down a little bit, it's just because I'm reading off of some notes because there is a lot to unpack here. Now, I'm going to be showing you guys a video of Anna before she turned into the person that she is today. Take a look. Anna Matskovich was previously a dancer and singer years prior to her going crazy. And there seems to be lots of videos out there. You can even find her record of dancing on WorldDanceSportFederation.com. So that kind of like confirms a lot for us. But not like too much at the same time, if you know what I mean. So we actually found her dance partner by the name of Isla Ligostav. And he won a dance competition with Anna coming in at sixth place. But there is no photos of them. There's like a photo of him, but not him and Anna together. The amount of YouTube channels that there are like out there at the moment with Anna's name on it, the amount of videos is just, it's just insanity really. And we actually found out that her husband actually runs one of these channels. There is a super detailed description for one of these videos, which we will read now. But like, here is the weirdest part of the description, right? It says, P.S. On 15th of August 2014, my wife Anna Matskovich was attacked in Moscow district by hooligans who blocked her in post office and called police, which also blowed Anna and forwarded her to the psychiatric clinic with lie accusations. On the 19th of August, she was brought to so-called court hearing under strong psychotropic medicals. Did I say that right? Before the hearing and that Anna is in the clinic by fabrications by paid liars were ignored by the judge from local Moscow court Mr. I can't read that name. AS, who made decision for forcible treatment of Anna Maskevich in the psychiatry clinic. I visited Anna next day after hearing she informed me that it is forbidden for her to even move inside the room where she was isolated. It is also very limited for her just to wash her face. She does not get back her glasses. And then it just goes on to some more kind of weird stuff. Like if that's seriously true, that is absolutely like downright horrible. And there is another claim that was going around. And if you don't know Anna's husband's name, by the way, his name is Maxim Belov, if you guys wanted to do further research on him. And to sum up a lot of the stuff that was said, she was continuously protesting and expressing things that she thought weren't right to the public. She ended up being detained because of it. Apparently when she was being detained, she was injected with all sorts of drugs, which makes her act the way that she does, which is what we see on social media. Thank you. 
And she was forcefully stuck inside a room without her glasses being given back to her. So there's a lot of this weird stuff going on. It is super, super strange. If you guys have any more information you can uncover or unveil for this channel, make sure to DM me on my Instagram account. Um, there is still a lot of speculation that all the creepy accounts on TikTok are somehow linked to Anna because Anna follows quite a few of them, like the dude that we reported on yesterday, the Dima Dima guy, the guy that was supposedly stalking a girl, which I don't think is real at all. I just think it's like a strange hoax. But guys, let me know what you think in the comments section below. How weird is this? I love you guys so much. Thank you again for tuning into another one of my videos. I will catch you guys tomorrow in the next video.